this is the uh, continuation, I guess, of the other video about the uh, stuff I got shipped. Uh, this is the motherboard that I ordered. It's a Foxconn destroyer. It's a uh, GeForce uh, chipset. This I think is um, an NVIDIA GeForce. 8200 chipset and it's a uh, pure HD it's also the motherboard it's a uh, tri SLI maybe uh, fourth it has uh, space for a fourth fourth car in there it can handle phenom phenom FX phenom quad uh, Athlon times two and then Semper it also I heard it also handles the uh, the new uh, with the update it handles the new Phenom 2 which is I think 3 gigahertz quad and uh, this is what it looks on the back it says uh, quantum bios hybrid power and pure HD the hybrid power when you have hybrid power I think is this one comes in the GeForce boost They have this too. The GeForce Boost helps the video cards to uh, clock better, I think. And uh, comes with a 7.1 HD audio, high definition. And uh, really, uh, one thing about uh, sound cards, I tried one of those FX um, sound cards, and from I think it was created. Horrible. You shouldn't go with uh, sound cards. This uh, motherboard, the new motherboard, is already coming up with a high-end uh, sound cards. Like it says right in here, you don't really need that. And if you really want to go with a real sound from what you already are getting in the uh, motherboard, try going with this one. Budget Tech C2300, I think they are. If I'm not wrong. That's another one. And that's the sub. And I tell you, the sound that comes out of this thing is pure HD. Once you hear the music from this thing, that's the uh, control that came with it. Once you hear the music from this thing, you will know what music sounds like. <laughs> and, uh, Okay, let's uh, open up the uh, box and see what's inside. Comes with, this is a 120 millimeter fan, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's a clear 120 millimeter, millimeter millimeter fan. Comes with the uh, destroyer badge. Very cool feature. This is the uh, this is the external heat sink pipe, I guess we'd say, for the uh, chipset. Yeah, all copper. So if you're a cool freak, this thing will do for you.
pretty cool feature. And uh, there's this thing in there. This uh, electrostatic bag in there. I don't know what this is for. Gotta read the instructions. It's probably the uh, or the uh, turn buttons turn on and off. Not sure what it is. And uh, motherboard. Check it out. Wow. That's the heat sink pipe for the chipset. It's all the way up here. All copper. And on the back too. It's got copper fans. And the copper plate. See, it connects right to this one, to the one that's next to the uh, next to the motherboard. I mean the uh, CPU. Cooler. This one right here. And uh, it's got a pin connected for the power of the uh, CPU. 24 pin connected for the model port. It's got one CPU fan. It's got a regular fan, one. And uh, another one over here, that's two. And another cool feature I like about it is that it's got um, the uh, reset buttons for the BIOS. This little black and yellow one. So if you ever mess up with the bias, it's right in there for you. And another fan connector, that's three, right here. And four. And now to the good stuff. Or PCI Express 2.0 times 2 times 16. Which are the next generation of video cards connectors. Very nice. Four four of them. One, two, three, four. And the PCI Express. PCI, I mean. And another one. And the uh, 7.1 HD audio. Two land. For super fast speeds. Six, I think it is. USBs connector 2.0 SATA two SATA connectors for three gigahertz fast uh, transfer of data I think data and uh, DVI and DHV connector and uh, this one right here, I think, is for the uh, for the motherboard, uh, keyboard, and the other two uh, USBs. That's pretty much it about the motherboard. So if you have any questions about the motherboard, let me know. The next uh, video will show you the uh, all the stuff that came with it.